Describe a place away from your home and you want to visit in future. Where you would like to go, when you would like to go, who you want to go with, and why you want to visit this place. I am a kind of person who loves traveling. I had visited a number of different places in my life. Sometime I prefer to visit these places with my family and sometime with my friends. There are a number of places that I want to visit. Here, I would like to talk about a beautiful country named New Zealand, which I would love to visit in the future. It is known for its breathtaking landscapes, diverse natural wonders, and rich cultural heritage. New Zealand offers a truly enchanting experience. I have always been fascinated by its stunning mountains, pristine lakes, lush forests, and picturesque coastlines. Ideally, I would like to visit New Zealand during the spring season when the weather is pleasant and the scenery is at its finest. Springtime brings vibrant blossoms, greenery, and mild temperatures, making it the perfect time to explore the outdoors and soak in the beauty of the country. This year I was not able to go there because of some personal issues, but next year I will definitely go there. As for the company, I would love to visit my dream place with my close friends or family members. Sharing such an extraordinary adventure with loved ones would create lasting memories and add to the joy of the journey. Exploring the stunning landscapes, engaging in thrilling outdoor activities, and having good time together with them would make the trip even more special. The main reason is, I am eager to get knowledge about the rich Maori culture and the indigenous heritage of New Zealand. From visiting traditional Maori villages to witnessing cultural performances and trying traditional cuisine, I believe it would be a deeply enriching experience that will broaden my understanding of the world. This will also be one of the memorable experiences which I can cherish for the rest of my life. Where do people prefer to go on holidays? People prefer to go on holidays to a variety of destinations based on their preferences and interests. Popular choices include beach destinations, where individuals can relax, soak up the sun, and enjoy water activities. Cultural and historical cities attract travelers who seek to explore museums, landmarks, and immerse themselves in local traditions. Nature enthusiasts often opt for destinations with scenic landscapes, such as mountains or national parks. How does tourism lead to cultural exchange? Tourism leads to cultural exchange by bringing people from different regions and countries together. Travelers have the opportunity to experience new customs, traditions, and languages firsthand. They interact with locals, engage in cultural activities, and try local cuisines. Through these interactions, tourists gain a deeper understanding and appreciation for diverse cultures, while also sharing their own customs, thus fostering a mutual exchange of ideas and values. Do boys and girls prefer to visit same kind of places? No, boys and girls do not necessarily prefer to visit the same kind of places. Preferences for places can vary based on personal interests, cultural factors, and individual preferences. Some boys and girls may have shared interests and enjoy visiting similar places, while others may have different preferences. It is important to recognize and respect individual differences when it comes to preferred destinations and experiences. Do Indian people like to visit historical places? Yes, many Indian people enjoy visiting historical places. India is rich in history and has numerous ancient sites and monuments that attract both domestic and international tourists. Historical places like the Taj Mahal, Red Fort, and Jaipur's palaces are popular destinations. Indians take pride in their cultural heritage and often visit these sites to learn about their country's history and experience the architectural marvels firsthand. Which means of transportation Indian people usually use? Indian people commonly use various means of transportation depending on their location, preferences, and accessibility. The most popular mode of transportation in India is the motorcycle or scooter and public buses depending on masses' preference. Trains are another widely used mode of transportation, with an extensive rail network connecting different parts of the country. Additionally, auto rickshaws and taxis are popular choices for local commuting and short-distance travel. What are some popular places in your country? Some popular places in India include the Golden Temple in Amritsar Sahib and Taj Mahal in Agra. 
Goa is known for its beautiful beaches and vibrant nightlife. The city of Jaipur, also known as the Pink City, is famous for its stunning palaces, forts, and colorful markets. In the north, the hill stations of Shimla and Manali are popular destinations for their scenic beauty and adventure sports opportunities.